This guy claimed that he was going to be fighting Brendan Schaub at Skanks Fest. So this got the whole fighter and the kid subreddit in a tizzy. This guy dropped a highly edited video claiming this was happening. No one knows who the hell this guy was, if this was true or not. So I went and asked Luis J. Gomez, and he said, no, this guy's not fighting Shav at the um, Skank Fest. But, um, so Luis J. Gomez dropped a video of him confronting him. So let's check this out, then I'll give you my thoughts on what I think is really happening here. But let's see this. on the internet. First of all, Yorgos, this motherfucker, he sends me a text message. He's like, hey, dude, I made this video. Do you mind if I post this? Do you care? And then I was like, I didn't even respond. I was like, this, he just, I was like, it was in the morning. I was like, I don't know, it means nothing to me. So then he posts it and he's challenging Brendan, or he said the contract to sign is a fight. I have a signed contract. I do. I have a signed contract between myself and Brendan Schaub for Skate Fest, boxing match, three two minute rounds. If he wins, subreddit, it's done. It's over. Shut it down. Yeah, EF Changs, shut down. <laughs> I already got the signed off on by everybody. I, it's like 96% approval on the subreddit. They're all on my team. You just said it was unanimous. Uh, so you're right. Look, <laughs> fine. He's got the contracts out, Brandon Schaub. Yorgos has decided to come out and train with us today. And uh, here's what I'll say. If Yorgos can hang with Team Rattlesnake, maybe he's got a chance against Brendan Schaub. But I just don't know. That's this is how unlikable Yorgos is. The fighter can suffer like Brendan Schaub more than Yorgos. That's fucking crazy. Guys, they How love is me. that possible? I'm their leader. They voted for me to be How their leader. How is that even possible? They love me. When I knock out Brendan Schaub, they're going to fucking adore me. All right? Look, ten, ten. There it is. One. There you go. My name is Ross. The homeless cat. Stop the seeing me the fucking weirdos. I'm okay, so obviously this is a buddy of Louis J. Gomez. And uh, I wonder how much of this was Louis J. Gomez's idea. I, I mean, this guy's a buddy. Maybe get some interest sparked up in the whole um, Brendan Schaub is going to Skanks Fest thing. But something tells me Louis has a lot more to do with this, the editing of the video, the fact that it, just the whole thing, uh, something fishy about this. But I think all of this is null and void anyway, as I don't believe for a second Brendan Schaub is going to go to Skanks Fest. I don't believe it. Not going to happen. And if he does go, he's not going to go. And Like, maybe this was Lewis's way of being like, maybe we get Schaub to fight. He, we can fight someone he can obviously beat up easily and he'll be a representation of the fighter and the kid subreddit and like this guy was like if i lose we shut it down and everything maybe this was done in a way to like so lewis can bring this to brendan Schaub as an idea and say hey you can just box this guy and he represents the fighter and the kid subreddit and you'll beat him in the ring or something but like i said i don't think Schaub is going to show up and if he does i guess it would just to be to do stand up in which he will be booed off the stage and so I don't know this whole situation here is kind of weird bizarre like I said I think Lewis has a lot more to do with this guy making these claims and doing these videos and claiming he's going to be because this guy is going to be at Skinks Fest he is one of Lewis's friends obviously so I don't know, whole thing's weird, but let me know your thoughts in the comments.